All right, good evening, everyone, and welcome to episode 10, we're on episode 10, of John and Eric and their into Skyrim. Wildlander. So, we got back into town. Uh, oh, welcome. We, so I, I did a little bit of uh, preemptive stuff here. So, I sold a few items, but right now, we have all of our, our major, uh, like the silver weapons that Let we picked up, still in our inventory from the last episode uh, in Dustin's Cairn. And we're officially a Companions member now, which is great. But we still have to sell all of our loot. Today, we're gonna be working on basically selling all of that loot. We'll probably do some alchemy, but I'm just gonna skip right over it. So that'll be available in the VOD. But for, for the video, I'm basically just gonna snap my fingers and we'll be done and we'll see what we get out of that and sell it. And then, the episode will conclude with us taking on Volfheim Tower, so that will be the uh, final exciting combat that we do. You're someone who can get things. Take a look. So we'll start by selling as much as we can. She has 3,900 gold. Um, sell here. So I I already checked, and basically all of these, like we we can sell. I've um I haven't actually saved the armor swaps yet. I forget. I completely forgot to save them. We're upgrading to our new Skyford Steel Greatsword. So the old one was 191 here. This is does like 50 more damage per swing. It's incredible. Um, we're not giving Eric two-handed weapons. So this thing's only worth like 300 gold. It's kind of surprising now. Um, where, where before I was like, oh, it was worth so much. And now it's just kind of like, eh, eh. This was Eric's old weapon. He now has a um, an orc piece which has a better base, what's the word? Um, base damage as well as it's enchanted. Um, oh, I bugged it out, hold on. Hmm. Blades, helmets, like pretty a weird much anything click. to um, So she only has 200 gold left, you can see right down there. Um. I guess we can sell one of our silver bars here. Cause I don't think we're gonna be smelting any jewelry. We need the perks for that. I sold one of those. She's out of gold. We're up to 15k Good gold. Luck out there. And we can move again. Yay! So next up, we're gonna be selling all the cloaks we have. Eric's holding all of those. What time is it? 6:20. too slow to follow us. There he is. Nope, Eric. It just feels right, Sam. No problem. How can I help? Oh my goodness, we still have all of these to sell, right? So we're gonna sell the Staff of Fury. Uh, he can keep the bow. All of these. So all of the clips. Still has this, dang. Okay. Uh, anything else? No, so it's mostly just the weapons now. Um and, and then that. And right, we Let's get going both here. of us have upgraded to the white bear cloaks. Yes. And I think I still have a third white bear cloak. In my inventory, so. Oh my god, he only has 700 gold. Alright, well. <laughs> crap. Um, we'll get rid of all the, the wolf skin cloaks, because those are the, uh, the least valuable here. Goodness. I was really hoping he would have a little bit more gold than that. Okay. All right, then. And we're still over encumbered. At first I thought I'd miss... What do you need? I was expecting him to have closer to, like, a thousand gold, but... You leave now. All right, let's try Eurlin Greyman because he he'll probably have a bunch of gold, right? I mean, hope. We're starting to run out of places to sell our goods. Um, oh, 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 oh! Can we? What about that archery shop? Can we sell like armor there? Medicine. We we can sell those silver arrows that Eric has, right? Let's see what we can sell there. Maybe he probably won't buy the cloaks, but we'll give it a try. Yeah. 
the uh, what is it? The drunken hunt. Let's see what we can sell here. Let me Before know. we go running all over town back and forth, right? Let's see, Eric. Eric. There we go. Not Eric. Eric. Oh, okay. I was like. No problem. How can I help? So yeah, the hundred and seven silver arrows. Right, we're not gonna give him any. Um, we can try if seeing if we can I sell can any of the. Uh, oh, hello, an archer. We buy the cloaks. I don't think he's. You need. No, he won't. But we can sell. Freaking. Start with that many. So fifteen is good. I think fifteen is a good like base amount. The other things that he's willing to buy the gems. Thank you very much for your business. Anything left? Or is it all gone? It's probably like, oh, okay. Like a hundred silver arrows, right? Imagine, like, imagine if somebody came up to you and sold like a silver arrow. How many that one? It's in real life, like, hot. So, we're going to Belathor last because I think he's going to give us like the worst deal. Although, Grilling Greyman's kind of a not exactly the friendliest guy, but I hope that he'll still give us like a good deal because we're literally a companion. I think we're also supposed to claim like a weapon from, but and, and I did test this. So like I, I was told that you have a weapon for me. The thing is, the weapon mm -hmm. isn't. It doesn't have like a uh, what, what is it the the first rate like the it doesn't have a um, grindstone quality assigned to it. So it's like complete garbage. And it was like, are you kidding me? It was, it's just very frustrating. So I don't know. I don't know how we're going to, uh, mm -hmm. I guess, reconcile that. Like we can, we're yes, still going to grab I the weapon. I can fashion whatever kind of weapon you want. Finest forge in Skyrim right here before you. Right. But so like if we take a, uh, one's most valuable that we can sell. Right, maybe a um, a battle axe. Just like Ysgrimor himself. And when we get it, right? So he gives us the Skyforge seal, Skyforge steel battle axe, which which is that it was actually better than our old one. Um, but but at the same time, like this is a faster and higher quality weapon. But you know, it's worth seven hundred gold. So I ain't much for talking. That's still worth it. <laughs> I guess I'm not really complaining. It's still worth 700 gold. He has 4,500 gold. That's what we're talking about. Much better. Start with that, right? Here's here's your weapon. Give me the gold. And we'll uh, do our two uh, silver bars as well. We done? If I can make enough money, what do you need? Oh, Yorlin, you're such a charmer. So we're gonna take all these enchanted weapons here, ten steel swords, and this thing. Which it's so so it does illusion spells are better. But the thing is, if we have this as our primary armor, so it's it's the same. It's not even as good as the one that he has here. Not gonna use the enchantment, and it's more difficult to improve it on an anvil. So it. It doesn't really make sense you lead. for us to to use it, right? Anything anything that has the same armor but it's just more expensive to enchant or to maintain it, it doesn't make sense, right? That's well, that's my opinion. So let's start with the really heavy stuff, right? So that um there was one of these that had a. Uh, 25 that deals uh, 25 damage. They're all like 10 or 15. So I guess we'll just sell them all. Um, I could probably break one of them down, but oh, whatever. Oh my goodness. He's barely going to have enough gold for everything we're doing here. Seven, six, and then five, four, three, two. So we took all of Yorlin's money. We're at 20k. Look at that. 
the 20k cash. And welcome, Kai. Welcome. We're uh, we're trying to sell all of our stuff. I'll take my leave then. Oh, we um. So here's the thing: we can we can spend all of our gold on training, or we can buy property. And I I don't really know which of those is better. Like buying property is great because I think you can rent it out, even if you don't actually use it. So I've heard you. A I'm looking for work. Of Falkreath has asked for our help. Uh, it seems that a predator has invaded their home, and someone needs to clear the beast out. This I don't think this would count as like a task to help the citizens of Falkreath, right? Until next time. What do you got? You still need to prove yourself, Welp. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for work. The idiots in Falkreath still think the best place for prisoners is that hole in the ground. No surprise, but one of them has gotten out again. At this point, they don't care what happens to him, and neither do I. Best to just kill him and be done with it. All right then. All right. And then the third option that we have is come to me with questions. I know our history almost as well as Vignar by now. 404 work not found. What brings you to me? Find Put some on here. strange creature in your travels? I think by now. Yeah, I that's kind of weird. Uh, but but let's swing. look at the training here. Let me show you. So, for two-handed, actually super cheap. Um, right. what other training was I looking at here? Um, we yeah we could throw it into two-handed. Let me take a look at the skills. If we decide what we're going to uh to level here. Wow, our speech is level fifty. Does that unlock anything? Yeah, it does. Look, um, merchants will buy anything from you except stolen goods. Prices are fifteen percent better. You can invest in shops to permanently increase their available gold. Ooh. Yeah, leadership. We we don't have that yet. Um, that's interesting. Lock picking isn't good enough. We travel up here. Oh, those are, um... Hmm. We're so close to a block level up there. What happens when we get our block level up to 50? Armor penalties are reduced, more carry weight, more stamina. That can be helpful for, like, heal healing auras, but... I feel like heavy armor is actually a lot more difficult to level than two-handed. So we might... Go with that. That's Farkas. That uh, teaches us uh, heavy armor. So we're gonna go train with him. It, it's not that much. It's gonna be like two thousand gold, I think. About well, five levels. So I think we'll take it. We have so much money, and we're accumulating it at an incredibly rapid rate. Also, Skior says that I have the strength of you. See, I'll show you what I can about protecting yourself. What he gives? A, oh, so no. See, this is what I was confused about. I was like, wait a minute. So, if this is 12k, why was it that one-handed was, like, 500? A little, well, I guess it's just because it's more difficult to train? That doesn't make sense to me. I thought it was the same cost regardless of the level. Hmm. I want to do a, like, a quick save here. Just to see how much it's going to cost for five levels. Some people don't think I'm small. I'll show you what I can about protecting So we start at 21k. And it basically costs like 6k. Yeah, okay, well, fine. Ugh, fine. That's basically the entire haul that we ended up getting from... Um, what is it? The... Last quest, but We've we're gonna go with a letter it. about someone. I don't know what the. F I just need you to go out. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing. Understand? You go fight someone here in White Run. Yeah, we'll give Get it a try. It then. When you have a big heavy weight swinging around your upper body, your lower body has Farngar. Farngar didn't learn his lesson last time, huh? What can you do? He's level 50, man. He's terrifying. <laughs> I really don't want to get into a fight with him. So, 
So we'll go fight him really quickly. And let me double check if there's anything else we can really do. So we have to assist the people of Falkreath. And we're not going to help uh, Barbus anytime soon. Oh, hell, welcome. Yeah, I'm getting these lag spikes today. It's interesting. That's okay. We, uh, we ran around, we sold all of the, uh, the stuff that we picked up, and then we immediately spent all of that gold on leveling, which, you know, may or may not have been a, a good investment, but level up heavy armor. I think it's probably a good investment. Any, any extra perks that we can put into it is going to be valuable. How much is the house here in Piper? Divines bless you. Yeah, it's 25 ground you walk quick as you pass. But to get all of the upgrades, it's more like 32k or something. Divine smile on you, friend. Uh, am I looking at the wrong person Take here? Care of your... no. No. Right. Good to see you. Um, oh, here it is. It, it was just grayed out. Come on. What was that? I think he's wearing robes. What? <laughs> and just like that, I got a, a level up to 43 and a total level. Not bad. <laughs> look tougher than you look. Fine, I'll take care of it. Please leave me alone. When are you gonna learn this lesson, old man? Great. So, let's see. We could start to specialize in our uh, great swords here. If we really wanted to. I mean, we have a nice great sword. We have our... Um, I don't, I don't foresee not not using the Skyforge Seal sword for a while, because this is basically like the best thing we could possibly find. So it might be worth specializing into it. We already have both of those. I think we're gonna do it. I think we're gonna do our first weapon focus right here. And then I'm probably going to keep the next perk for block. I don't really think there's much else we can do. Maybe we could throw it into alchemy. But, uh... Maybe to speech instead. Tough to say. We, uh, we actually have the ability now to get... Buy some more levels if we want to. So we could spend another... 6,000 gold to level our heavy armor. We we'll do that. <laughs> Monkey jump our way over. We'll turn in our quest and then we'll think about it. I I'm thinking My we might do it. Is a better Took care of the problem. Push people around sometimes, isn't it? Under go. Good work, brother. Looking for some trouble in the pale. Hell, nah, no thanks. Out an enemy we'll feel that way for a while, but eventually you'll get used to it. Come to me with questions. It's all in the swing. Yeah, see, it's he's basically the same level, but significantly cheaper. So. What well, when I like harbinger? When I was young, I favored you. Skior says that I, I have the strength. I think we're gonna I'll go for it, what right? Because what else am I gonna do with all this, with all this gold that I'm holding? It'll put us at um 40, a uh, 48, really good. So, oh my wallet! Ah, so much for a house. Until next time, big sword. Well, you can't buy a house if you're dead, right? So. Brave hearts beat lesser ones. That already puts us halfway to level 14, so that's pretty good. We still require another quest. Another companion's quest. We'll go outside and see what we Ideally, we're just taking kind of the quick work. 
Character doesn't seem like a house steward type. You still need to look for a bit of a sensitive matter this time. Okay. A wealthy family has misplaced one of their heirlooms. I tell you, this province is losing its grip. The bandits become more brazen every day. Well, they didn't tell me where it Until is. Until next time. I've heard you may. The Jarl of Falkreath has asked for our help. Yeah, he asked it for a lot of help. Predators have taken up residence and have been attacked. Someone's got to head out there and take care of the beasts. Can't you just tell me if the grip is bad? If they are made it, it's more likely you're. Mm. Find me tomorrow and we can. Mm, okay. Good. I knew that we could count on you. It's simply a beast, but be cautious. The beasts of Skyrim are made of sterner stuff than most. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's vague and we don't know what it is, but how how hard could it be, right? So is is it a cave or Greywater Grotto? That is super vague and unhelpful. We don't know what's in there. We'll try. No promises though. Oh my goodness. This lag. I'm tempted to do a restart. Just here, one, one sec. All right, so we are here. Valheim Towers lays right ahead. So the time now is we're gonna take all of our stews, all of our buffs, this, this. Am I still hungry? Caterpillar, man. We. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we're gonna do a quick F2 and make sure that Eric has a healing aura on him. Eric needs it a lot more than I do. Uh, we'll probably put one on me too. And when we switch back, I don't think I properly hotkeyed all of the armor. So I'll just, uh, just to double check to make sure I got everything. Oh, there we go. Nice. One on me. Quick swap. Yeah, see, I, I'm not wearing any boots. So I almost got them. Uh, and the new bear skin too. That's... So we do have our, our Staff of the Storm Atronach. Really need it. What else? Um, I'm going to throw on a Bone of her scene. Um, there we go. Stamina's buffed. Let's go. Buffs are up. What could possibly go wrong, right? Look, we can run infinitely. Like, so, so we basically have infinite sprint. That's nice. Hold it. This here's a toll road, see? You're gonna have to hand over, say, 200 gold if you want to use our road. Mmm. How does 50 gold sound? Eh, fine. So we'll take a little bit of speech XP, right? Just get out of here before I change my mind. Might pay off my bounty this time. Walk into the city of free man. Now we're gonna take a quick look around, right? We got one guy over here, right? Well, this guy's looking pretty tough. But I think what I'd rather do is take out mages. Oh, they're not even responding. Oh. Huh. And oh, we're still hidden. <laughs> Gotta love that AI, huh? Oh. All right, then. Oh, well, we're off to a good start. My goodness. Did it earlier today? Yeah, huh. That's interesting. Uh, how's my inventory doing here? Hey, got another beef stew. Drag this. Oh, <laughs> I was like, we'll drag this guy over here so we can remember to deal with them later. Um, I thought there was another one. That was like right here. No, it's not. Oh, 
need to be a little bit more uh, careful, right? A little bit more mindful. Oh! Alright, come on, come here. Oh. Block the whole damn thing. Man, we are just cutting through them like butter. Oh. <laughs> Oh, and his weapon, too, man. All right. Anybody up in here causing trouble? No? Eric! Good lord, man! I think they're all stuck on the bridge. Oh, okay. Oh, here we go. This is where things start to get a lot more real. Come on. Cool, got one. I'm gonna do a crude healing potion just to. Ah. Trying to take out all the lackeys here. Out of stamina. And he was brave. Coming in here with that little health. Whoa! I thought that was Herrick. Is she not gonna fight? Alright, okay. Hey, come on. Ooh. Need to take out that archer. I can take you. But I can't turn my back. Oh, okay, yes we can. Oh. Where is he? I lost the archer. Can't figure out where he is. Careful, Eric. Uh, let's do a slightly better one here. Decent. She has like unlimited stamina. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Oh, right, look, a chest. All right, that. <laughs> That's gonna be. You know what? I think we'll be okay with just a good one. As long as we stay underwater for a little bit. Luckily, we can swim with our armor. Wow. Where's that stupid archer? You're a disgrace to your own kind. Ah! Damn! Alright, well, block that one. Alright. We're going remarkable here. Because one more hit like that, and we're pretty screwed. Where'd that come from? Where are they? I can take you. All right, let's just go for it. There we go. Now, where is this stupid archer? Oh, they're freaking by the rock. Goodness. Sloppy at best. That everyone, Eric? <laughs> Eric's like, pay me.
I don't know if that's everyone, so we're going over here just to double check. I think that was it. Ugh. I got some skooma. And a pickaxe. I'm gonna put that back. Iron. I think there's some corundamore around the, uh, the corner. Alright. So this is, um... The, the sword that we had to pick up for... Oh my god, I'm completely spacing on his name. I'm just happy this isn't like an expert lock, because that's happened before, where we come here to claim this chest, and it's like, you can't open it. It's like, okay. I guess that's a problem. Oh. It's like it moves. Or I'm just terrible at lock picking, which is more. Should have done more uh, burial rites on the bandits. Why am I just like really screwing up here or like what the hell's going on, man? There we go. So here's his family sword. Oh, amulet of Talos, okay. Bedroll, healing poultice, potions. This is actually kind of a, a hot garbage chest, but we got that sword. Okay, we'll take, here, I'll, I'll take one of those crude potions right now. You can probably give the rest of the crude potions to Eric. I don't know if he knows how to use them or not. If, if you read that journal, it's incredibly sad. But... It just hey, feels right. Eric. What do you need? Let's see if you are capable of using this. Probably not. Let's get going now. I don't have to carry them as much. Oh. Oh. Like, that chest was better than the other one. Could take the drum. We will not. There's also an ore vein over there that I was mentioning, and I feel like running over there. Mining ore. I think it was kind of cool that we discovered um, like a hidden chest, so we're going to go look at that. Uh, I'll take one of these. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, we'll take all the leather stuff, right? Or we'll break it down. Give it to Eric. Back here, some garlic. That's a remarkable. Um, that might replenish what we used. Mm. I think that's good enough. Here, Eric, I'm gonna have to give you some some stuff because I'm definitely about to be over encumbered. What's so heavy in here? Probably that. Um, oh, and the tent. I forgot to drop the tent off. That definitely doesn't help. Lead off. I should drag over the horse. Then, uh, then we'll definitely have enough. Um. At this point, all of the iron stuff were, were kind of past it. Ugh. Weight to value just isn't good enough. Oh, okay, we took some bread. That that's fine too. We always we do always need leather though for, for all the metal that we collect. Breakdown. That's our that's usually our limiting factor. Crossbow. Uh, uh, yeah, we can sell it. Iron, eh. What else we got? Oh, there's so many of them. So this is why I wanted to wait a little bit before we took on Valheim Towers, was just at how... Like, we, we really almost died, right? We kind of... I'd say we got lucky here. 
but I don't know. Or no, it was skill. It was obviously all skill. Definitely, 100%. We're at carry weight right there, and then there's like a random glitched book in there. Crap. Let's do this one first. Oh. Okay. He's here. Nice. We could probably just bash this open, but more fun to watch me break lockpicks, right? All right, and now we take on everyone outside. Uh, let's call the horse. I it occurred to me that we don't have to actually. Um, what's that on the hill? Do you see, like right there? It's like a party or something, like a wandering party. Oh. Huh. Anyway, over here, horsey. At this point, we'll just freaking take everything, right? It isn't nailed down. We'll take all the iron and we can refine it into steel later. Loot all of the things. All of the things. Why not? I'll deal with it uh, off stream. Oh, oops. Well, yeah, that, that kind of works. And last but not least. Oh, yeah, we already looted her. Are we really going to strip her of her... All her... Uh, armor and what she's wearing? Yes. Same here. Well, that's just a pile of ash, so at that point we're we're just picking everything up. Alright, what do we have to deposit here? Basically, all of this. Except that. Hmm, and all the iron stuff. I'll break it down later. Still slight, barely over encumbered. How? What? What? What do you want? Weapons? Yeah, it's probably a few. Two sword, iron battle axe. Excellent. There we go. I think that's everybody. No, we forgot the chest down in there. Also, this guy. What you got? What you got? Was I using my uh, silver arrows or her staff? Did I take her staff? You sure? It's locked. Apprentice level. Look, luckily, we're we. It's kind of a miracle that we can uh, pick this. I mean, immersively, we're. Um, I would argue that you know this would take multiple tries. But after like an hour, we can probably get it. Whoa, okay. Look at this. Uh, consumes one firewood from the ca caster to restore 20 points of exposure. It's kind of cool. Um, increases damage dealt with one-handers by 20%. Good lord, we're gonna give these to Eric. Lots of potions, poisons, some rubies, stuff like that. Nice weapon. Nice. Oh, hey, look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy. Guild bracers, nice, 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 nice. Oh, is that an orcish dagger? Yeah, but now I'm over in comfort. Eric! Eric! No, Eric, get back here! This new armor fits me. No problem. How can I help? I offer you or where are they? Scaled bracers. Let me see exactly how like worse are they? Like they're <sighs> really good enchantment, but it's just the wrong armor type. Like I think we might save those in case we get a third follower that does light armor. That's how good those are. If there's any way I can be of service, please let me know. And we just find in bodies everywhere. Yeah, this was one that fell off. Okay, excellent. 
did it. We looted everyone. And I think I grabbed her staff. I'm not too sure. We, uh, I think we ended up missing who those people were that were walking by. But nice. So on the way here, we ended up killing a saber cat. Uh, that it took two hours in game. deal with our, our saber cat friend right here. It's because we need the ingredients. I don't know if we've learned all of the uh, different things that we can. Saber cat. Let's get the pelt. I, I don't really see the purpose of butchering Eat, but like, because I think that's a completely separate skill. We'll do it anyway. But. Alright, so what we're going to do next is we're going to go back into town. We'll sell off all the gear and turn in the quests. So I'll, I'll probably skip forward when we're turning the quests. And we'll see what we do from there. All right. Uh, you I this work? It might have your sword. You found it. I've been looking for that blade for months. You took on all those bandits yourself? Thank you. Well, you yeah. know, my father had a favorite sword health. and shield tech. He's probably he was probably talking about Eric and us. In Her. honor of his memory. Eric and me. Hey, we got our block level up though. That's pretty good. Travel safe. So we're we're actually gonna throw our. Uh, where is, where is block? We're gonna throw that perk in. Power bashing. Who on power bashing? I don't know if we're actually gonna use power bashes. See, this, this is kind of like shields, right? Power bashing with your shield will knock over opponents. Maybe not. Anyway, let's go turn in um, the other quest to the Arl. And we managed to get our carry weight down to like 170 out of 240, so that is really good. Um, all of We discovered that we had like yeah, 19 potions of cleansing from when we took on the Silver Hand, so good to get rid of those. And I think we turn in this bounty to dragons. Double check. Why we're running up here. Yeah, collect the bounty. Bounty! Bounty! He's probably upstairs. Yep, it's 2 p.m. He's having lunch. All the way out. That's fine. Bounty! <laughs> Just, just running through the halls, shouting, "We, we're here!" Good to see you. They're dead. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Six hundred, nice. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Excellent. Now, let's see. I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna end the, the stream with me doing a little bit of alchemy. And that'll be that. We're, we're gonna see if we can get to level 15 before the end of this. And I'm gonna use a crap load of ingredients. So I'm gonna quickly skip forward to me being in Arcadia shop with all of my ingredients. So, snap. So, there we go, we're back. Um, we, what we did is we got all of our ingredients off the horse and then we deposited all of our potions onto the horse. So we have no potions in our inventory right now. And what's going to happen is I am going to go, we are that far, that, that far, eh, that far, level 14. And our alchemy level is, I can find it, 17. What we're gonna do is we're gonna craft a bunch of potions and this is probably gonna take like 
at least 20 minutes just to craft them all and figure out what I'm going to do. And we're going to see what we get to. So there's there's the uh, if there's level. I can help so now I'm going to snap and we're going to see what that turns out. into. Right? Can snap. There we go. We, uh, we're back. We, we did end up getting a total level. We went all the way over. Right, there it is. One total level. Oh, no, 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 no. Crap. We could have done training. Ah. We just missed a training level. Damn. Oh, well. Oops. Wah, wah. But let's see how many potions we made. So not, I mean, it doesn't look like all that many, but 13 of these, 40, 42 frenzy uh, poisons, and then, a, you know, a couple water breathing. So, so it wasn't actually all that much, but now we're going to see how much they sell for. Good to see you. Ah, how much gold so does she have? Only 3k. Then. So we are not going to be able to sell. Oh. Well, um, I'm going to sell them one at a time because I want the, uh extra XP. Selling items individually increases your level of answer. Uh, yeah, we'll do this too. Which is just one of these. There we go. So there we go. We've sold, sold her out on all of her gold. Got a speech level up. And we're still over. Take care of yourself. But that's okay. We, uh, we'll be able to sell... A little bit more every day. I think that's going to conclude our stream. So we have a bunch of potions that we can sell now, and we'll slowly make our way around Skyrim, selling all of them. So thank you very much for watching, everyone. You guys have a wonderful night.